I lost my father when I was 10 to suicides. I think that people overlook the fact that everyone knows someone. Um, they've either lost someone or they know someone that's struggled, and it's, it's really something that's becoming prevalent. And so, you know, whatever we can do to kind of help inform a person that may not have any kind of mental health background or training or whatsoever, um, to be able to help, you know, their neighbor or their son or, you know, their friend even. Um, and we get that a lot. We get calls and messages and all sorts of things where people are, are trying to find out what they need to do. If it's someone that, that really just needs someone to talk to or to kind of go through what they're feeling and they don't feel like they're going to act immediately upon any kind of suicidal thoughts or anything, then, yeah, they, there's a national lifeline number. It's 1-800-273-TALK. A lot of times when you're talking about suicide, you're talking about addictions, and we all know that people that have addictions can, can really wear those relationships, um, family, friends, and so that person feels like they have just... Um, destroy that and that they would they would really help those that they love more by not being around because they feel like it would be less of a burden. We are a resource for the community. Um, we try and organize trainings and events. We're actually taking donations through the United Way of Garland County so you can look up United Way of Garland County on Facebook. You can go to facebook.com backslash prevent suicide Garland, Arkansas, or you can just search for suicide prevention in Arkansas. for animal blocks <laughs> <laughs> okay so let's get into it <laughs> cute look at the look at that mean ass cow over there to the left <laughs> fucking bitch ass fucking cute ass animals moo <laughs> okay so oh okay um so this is a um yeah because we were confused when we first looked at this at the beginning we were like what the fuck is this yeah okay that. So it's it's a matching game, pretty much. Like, but it has to be like, I don't know. I feel kind of, um, I don't want to say like this game is beneath us, but it's just a little too preschool ish. Yeah, it is. <laughs> like your son could get a lot out of this, but well, apparently his daddy can too. Look, I'm learning a lot right now from this <laughs> shit. I don't know what you're talking about. So, um, I don't know if I told you this earlier, but, uh, Christmas injury. What did you do? I, uh, well, I mean, Christmas leftover injury. I should be more specific. I, um, you know, I guess a lot of people do. I mean, it's different. Apparently it's different for families all over. You know, some people have turkey for Christmas dinner. Some people have ham, goose. <laughs> Hey, goose. Fetch me your finest goose. Or, you know, I don't know. People, Some people have fucking pizza. I don't know. But Dude. in our family, we always have, you know, Thanksgiving we have turkey. And then on Christmas we have ham. And right. it's always been the same ham, too. Like, pettigene ham here is fucking delicious. Mm. And the way my mom prepares it, you know, she before she gets ready to put it in the oven, she uh, bakes it with Coca-Cola. Oh my god! In there, that sounds amazing. It is amazing, dude. I don't know. I don't oh know my how. God. To, I mean, it, it sounds kind of gross because. Oh my I, god! As a kid, I didn't know what that brown stuff was in there, but <laughs> <laughs> all I know is that the ham was Mama, fucking delicious. What is this? It, I don't know what it, dude. It gives it a flavor. It's almost like a smoky flavor. But and anyway, um, so I was sitting there. Um, Cutting up my, uh, or, or making a, you know, nice little leftover dinner plate from Christmas dinner. And, uh, I should have used the, you know, the electric knife, the carving knife uh -huh. that almost every family has when it comes to this time of year. Just, you know, the, and the sounds of it are so 
terrifying? No, so familiar of like the holidays. <laughs> <laughs> I like too much change. <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's a very distinctive sound, right? Yeah. But I so I was like, no, nah, fuck that. I'm not, you know, I got to plug it up and you know put the blade in it, and I ain't messing with all that shit. So I just went and got like a regular carving knife out of the the, the drawer. And it was like one of these really big ones and stuff. I was like, perfect. So, you know, I got my for a couple slices of ham first, but I went back for another one. And I guess I was trying to go in too quickly or something, but I wasn't really paying. I guess I wasn't paying that much attention. And I just kind of went whoop. You did not. Right through my finger. Fuck, dude. And it was one of those moments where you're just like, the owie feeling sets in. <laughs> Oh, kind of like that same feeling you get when you my. watch like fail videos on YouTube where you watch these people like skateboarders and you watch them like face plant onto the ground. That's not the part that gets me. The face, the, the part that gets me when those face plants and stuff is when they face hits the ground, but also slides against the pavement. Yeah, yeah. That, that feeling right there, right? Yeah. Yeah. So take that feeling there for a few f seconds after slicing into my finger, just kind of like... <sighs> That and then washing, watching the my red gold mm. just flow down my hand and stuff. It just kind of like head cocked it to the side and like, oh, fuck, I'm leaking, and I'm leaking. <laughs> and then I, you know, my mom heard me. She was just like, what, what happened? What'd you do? Oh, what the fuck is that? My mom does not speak to me that way. I know. I'm sorry. You're right. I'm her baby. Yeah. But anyway, she's like, are you okay? What's going on in there? So I just kind of Do you need medical aid? <laughs> I just kind of walk in there, like, cut my finger. And then, you know... Why the hell did you do that? My stepdad's just like, well, way to go, moron. <laughs> Numb skull. That's... And then I just went on and on about how, you know, this is, what, this is how you want to be talking to your family when Jesus comes back. On people that you supposedly love, morons. Oh, it's playing. We really were, Kevin. I'm sorry. We did. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, I had to go into the, the bathroom and search for like 45 minutes to find one damn band aid. And of course, none of them were the right size. It was like those little bitty ones. Like right here, this is like eight band aids to make one whatever. Yeah. You don't say. But after I bandaged it up and everything, you know, it's just like you could feel it throbbing like, uh, uh, uh. Something's happening to me. Something's trying to get loose. There it is again. Maybe something's trying to break its way into our world. Okay, out of every one of these animals here, the lion looks the badass out of the entire group. Because look at him. It looks like it has the most detail. It looks awesome. And like you got this derpy looking little hippo. Like, Duh, what do you want? Wait, which one's the lion? Look at the lion right here. Oh, I see him. See, the lion looks badass, but everything else is like, da. Pussy cat. Pussy cat, pussy cat. I hate you. Okay, so, yeah, right, right, right where do you go down? Yeah, what is that supposed to be? What? That you just. A uh, bear? Oh, is that supposed to be a bear? I guess. Let's see, so that's a rabbit and it's a deck. The tiger mm. looks okay. Yeah. And there's a fox. I guess that's a duck. Or a bird of some sort. Yeah, the fox, bulldog. There's a lion. I guess that's supposed to be a kitty cat. Where? Where? Oh, that one? Yeah. No, I think it looks like a dog. Could be. No, let's see. Look, that looks like a cat right there. Okay, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> that looks like a cat. Very good. Well, anyway. Um, yeah, I guess, yeah, I guess that is a bear. Kevin, what, what is this animal? <laughs> Can you name that animal, Kevin? Um, move the fucking thing out of the way. What is that animal? A mogwai? I don't know. What is that? Very good, Kevin. It was a mogwai. Seriously, what, what was that supposed to be? I think it was like a deer. I don't look like Bambi. I don't know. Nobody knows what Bambi looks like. He got shat. <laughs> That's like Bambi's mother. <laughs> she didn't get killed, dude. She got... <laughs> This is how she made her living. She went on vacation. <laughs> I'll be back, I promise. This is like Animal Kingdom's ver uh, version of porn. Like, Bambi's mother was a porn star. 
What if she really was? What was his mother's name? Just mother, for all we know? I guess. Damn, what if she was like a porn star? I remember at the end of that where, you know, Bambi's dad shows up. Or I guess it was, it was I always thought as a child that it was Bambi's dad. Yeah, what if it really wasn't? Like, like when what the, if it was just forest? like someone that was like actually very dangerous? Actually, when you think about it, I don't really remember all that much about Bambi. Bambi is that one Disney movie that I have not seen in years. It, it was one of those movies that my uh, my mamma used to always make me watch. Like, ugh, every time we came over, it was Bambi. Bambi. Oh, I know. You kids want to watch some Bambi. So clearly she just put that on to keep you guys quiet yeah, and out of her to, hair. Just to shut us up. And <laughs> Oh, my God. These bastard kids. Ugh. So, and you know what's the weird thing is? As much as she made me watch Bambi... I don't remember a whole lot about Bambi. I, dude, it was so long ago. I don't really remember. I mean, bits and pieces. I remember... Because you know all Disney movies back then had, like, songs and stuff in it, right? Right. Did Bambi? I'm sure it did. Like, I don't, I don't really remember any any songs from that movie. Maybe it didn't. I, I mean, remember I remember the, I mean, the, the key at, characters. Uh, look at um Old Yeller. It doesn't have any... Never seen Old Yeller. Really? I know what happens in it. I don't want to. I, I, it's, uh, I don't yeah. want to see it. I didn't really think about that. Yeah. Sorry, I forgot about that shit. I think in in either junior high or high school, we had the choice of we had to make a choice of what um, book we wanted to read as a class, and you know to ultimately you know what we're gonna do read the, read the book and then watch the movie and then do a report on it, right? Right. So. Um, one of the choices was Old Yeller, and I told, I was like, not doing it. Nope, not doing it, because I know what happens. <laughs> poor, poor doggy. Oh, what the fuck? Dude, the way my eyes look right now, that doesn't look like it says, <laughs> it doesn't look like it says game over. It looks like it says game over. No, it looks like it says to me. At first, I thought it said boner. You want to try it? Yeah. That's okay. Yeah. 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 You, I knew you were going to do that. Stop making fun <laughs> of my voice. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and just kind of break away from this for a little bit and kind of kind of talk about some games. Let's stop talking about games and talk about some games. Uh, no, I'm just I'm done with retro for now. Um, so Brian got me Wind Waker HD for the uh, Nintendo Wii U, and I have been playing the shat load of it lately. Like they the came over shat load. Yeah, they came over tonight. To record. Yes, yes, I know. I can still smell them both. And uh, while they were recording, I was just on the Wii U, just like, it kind of, I was kind of like, I guess I was sort of part of the episode, but I was just like, eh. I was like in and out because I was sitting there playing the Wii U. <laughs> I was like, this is y'all's episode, not mine. I'm just fucking here. Because I got really nowhere else to go. Wow. <laughs> so <laughs> I just kind of like just crashed in on their okay, episode. So... You gotta match the animals, kid. I know I am matching the animals, but it won't let me select it right there. You gotta push. You gotta push uh, um, B, I think. Yeah, that one. And... I know. It won't oh, be... it can't be in the middle. That's that's right. That's one of the rules. It can't be in the middle. It has to be on the edge. It has to be like on the corner. So say like, okay, for example, um, see, okay, go down right there. Oh, go up, go up. Click on that and go to the top, very top. Click on that one. Yeah, because they're on the edge. So say like, you, you, do you get it? Like it has to be on the edge. You can't you can't click on something in the middle. Okay, I get it. Anyway, this um, makes it's gonna take so fucking long. <laughs> you could do this, Kevin. I have strong, high hopes in you. What is this supposed to be anyway? Is like the the, the shape? Is it like the? Uh, the justice and liberty uh, thing. Oh, you mean the scales? Yeah. <laughs> justice and liberty. Justice, yes, is what the scales represent. Well, also, justice apparently has also, a fox, a dog, a cow. But also, you know, the scales represent Libra of the Zodiac. Does it? Mm hmm What if it's just like a guy holding up two trash bags? If you like. <laughs> Zach, it could be a woman that looks like a dress. Damn. Do you need some help? 
No. I don't. I don't need your help. There's deers. You can get the deers down the bottom. Hey, go. Look at you go. Yeah. Yeah. It does not look like a deer to me. Oh, fine. It could be an antelope. <laughs> get the doofy hippo. See, there's one right there, too, at the top right. Yeah. And then go, yeah, yeah. Mm, boom, baby. You got yeah, it. I want to play Hungry Hungry Hippos. Oh, my God. Yeah, dude. That should be uh, that should be my game to play for so Gamegasm. Dumb. We could do, like, a live game. Mm-hmm. This really is a dumb game. I'm sorry. Like, I, I, I mm, mm Oh, it just blew up the man taking his trash out. Just blew up his head. My head! That's my favorite head. That's my favorite head. Hey, you can click on some cute little animals. I've got a head for you. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> you know who that just reminded me right of, What's right? What's that? Oh, Family Guys, uh, George Takai. Oh, oh, my. Oh, my. I just family guy that we did that, right? You're gonna click on some animals, you know? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe click on a, a a duck? Click on a quack, duck. Quack, quack. Click on a duck. Yeah. That go, no, that's a, that's a chicken. That's a duck. Damn it. I know, they look the same, don't they? No, there's one right there and I one on the right. I see it, I see it. Yeah. <laughs> I see it. You Good don't looking have to out, Oh, there's, now there's the chicken. Which came first, the duck or the chicken? <laughs> well, personally, I think it's the quail. I think the quail came first. Oh my god. What? I love you, but you infuriate me at the same time. The horse. The horse, bro. The horse. Put is a horse that on what around. that is? Put a horse on a <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, there's the cool-ass lion. <laughs> the Leo. The lion. He is king. <laughs> Le -ger. He is king of animal jungle thing. Oh my god, I need my glasses. Where's the other one at? <laughs> I clicked on it, I was like... How misleading would this be if it was like, titled Jungle Book? <laughs> you title it Jungle Book and this is the game that you get? Fuck. We didn't specify what kind of book it was. Okay, so... Could I do that one? Could I do that? You can get the... Yeah, you can get the monkey. Monkey? Yeah, go middle right. See the monkey down there? By the cat. Click on that one. And go down. Yeah. Is that what that is? That's yeah. a monkey? I'm assuming that's a monkey. It's like a big fucking blob of... I don't know what the fuck it is. I was, okay, I'm, I'm trying to figure it out. <laughs> I'm scared. I don't know what anything is anymore. Should we just call it next time on Gamegasm? Because, I mean, well, we're... I'm getting kind of getting into this now. <laughs> <laughs> we'll extend this one out for just a little bit longer. Fine. Next time on Gamegasm. I think... What? what? Next time on Gamegasm. What'd you say? What, I, um, hey, Kevin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we were just saying some good things about I you. I bet you were. Mm. Oh, come on. Can you seriously not see it? Can you not see it? The pig. There's a pig? Yeah. See the pig right there, the, right there on the left. Oh, you're right, dude. I totally did not see that. See, you see now. You see, you get the tigra. I see. You get the tigra. I yeah. see. Um, us having a discussion about letting you pick games. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're not having a blast playing the uh, retro, uh, whatever it's called. Um. Well, you know me. I'm always up for playing new games, no matter if it's retro or um, <laughs> new. Why are you laughing at me? Nothing. No reason at all. Am I doing bad? No, you're doing great. Am I stupid? Am I ugly? No, no. Fuck! <laughs> Shit! No, you're fine. That man. was really loud. I'm sorry, you're right. What would Jesus think of me? Who? Huh? <laughs> No, my penis always thinks very highly of you. Next time on Gamegasm. Yeah, next time on Gamegasm. Thanks for watching! And hey, if you don't push that subscribe button, you're a stinky pickle!